Hello, this is Holger from Autogefühl today on a new Ford store. It's a new showroom, showroom concept from Ford uh, to sell cars, especially in the Ford stores you can buy two cars, the new Ford Mustang and the new trim level of the Ford Mondeo, the Ford Vignale. Vignale? What is this? I ask it to Mr. Uli Köster's Ford Motor Company. Hello and welcome to uh, Rome. Um, I would like to show you some of the unique aspects of what makes the Ford, first Ford Vignale a special vehicle for us. So the very first Vignale is based on the Mondeo model and it has some unique features that uh, make it stand out from the base model. Um, starting on the outside, I would like to point out the uh, specific grille that you see. Um, that is in shape common with the base Mondeo model, but you see the grill opening is uh, made of a hexagonal um, um, a pattern which is uh, coming in a dark metallic paint and has a, a polished chrome surround to make it uh, stand out. Um, also the fog lamp bezel is made of uh, polished chrome which uh, gives the whole vehicle a premium look, which is fully consistent with the concept of the Vignale model. Um, the, the first iconic um, person who felt it's necessary to combine style and design with technology feature was uh, Alfredo Vignale. He founded a company in Italy in the middle of the last century, and that's the example that we used as a history point to build our Vignale concept around. Um, so we have some other design themes like the uh, unique wheels that you can get on the Vignale, 18 inch standard and 19 inch uh, op uh, optional as you can see here which is unique to the Vignale. Um, also we have a badge on the side which is the script similar to how Alfredo Vignale signed his uh, letters. Then we have some chrome stripes around the vehicle. You see that from the front and all around the vehicle. We can walk around in a second, but you see it on the doors and very decent stripe in each uh, uh, door uh, handle. So premium looking um, chrome applique in each door. Um, if we keep walking around the vehicle to the rear, the, the chrome is following the contour from the doors. The line is slightly uh, climbing up. So on the rear fascia you see one and you also see um, around here the two exhaust bezels which are standard, also held in uh, polished chrome. And then a unique to the Vignale um, chrome plate with, with the uh, badge in embedded um, Vignale to just show Ford and Vignale go together as our um, luxury um, offering. So that's in a nutshell uh, what makes up the new Mondeo Vignale from the outside. If you walk closer to um, the uh, paint uh, finish you can see actually um, that there is not only a special color used but also a special process to increase the width and the depths um, which gives you a, a brilliant color appearance but we also have a thicker clear coat cover on top which makes the uh, color more robust in everyday's use so that it keeps staying shiny for our customers. Please tell us something about the engines. Okay, if we walk around to the front, I, best is I show you one of the powertrains. Um, the Vignale model is uh, coming with our uh, top range um, gasoline and diesel engines, but on top of that we offer on the four-door body style 
um, the hybrid uh, version, which comes with a, uh, with a gasoline engine and an electric motor. Um, the uh, two body styles that we have are the four-door uh, and the uh, uh, wagon models. Um, and you can see here, this is the um, high power new addition in our lineup. It produces 210 uh, PS um, and from the low end uh, of the speed range uh, produces 450 Newton meters of torque. We generate that uh, with the help of two turbos. So one bigger one for the high output and a smaller one that is revving up fast. So at the low end rev range, you get quick response in uh, everyday condition when you need torque to be built up. Um, this um, engine is the top end of our diesel lineup. We then have a two liter single turbo, um, 180 PS horsepower uh, that comes with an automatic transmission as well as with a six-speed manual gearbox and you can have that one also in combination with an all-wheel drive for the first time. That's an intelligent all-wheel drive system that is uh, looking at combining signals and optimizing signals from the accelerator pedal, from the steering inputs um, and from the uh, wheel sensing um, uh, uh, brake system to make sure that it always distributes the torque to the wheel that uh, needs to transfer the torque to the road. So if you have slip, it detects it and then directs the torque to the other wheels. And that can, within less than 100 milliseconds, get the torque from the front axis all the way to the rear axis if needed. Which other cars will get the Vignale touch? Um, we have announced that our first model is going to be the uh, Ford Mondeo Vignale that is coming to dealers in July with an official market introduction uh, in September. And then we are going to introduce the production version of the Ford S-Max Vignale later this year. And that will come to dealers uh, next year. There are quite a few uplifting features integrated in the uh, all-new Vignale. Um, the, the first Ford Vignale model is actually the Ford Mondeo. It's based on our flagship because it, the starting point is very promising for us to provide the Ford Mondeo Vignale with a lot of technology features that are available in the base Mondeo already, but that are now standardized in the offering for the Vignale. The uh, key features that are distinguishing the Vignale model from the base Mondeo are intended to give an uplifting um, quality impression to the customers and to the driver. You can see that with the, on the instrument panel with a nice leather wrap. Um, this is special Windsor leather, um, pr uh, prime grade, um, manufactured in a very detailed process to make it feel soft and look extremely nice. It's a natural um, material, obviously, um, so it gives a very nice crafted impression. Um, this is what the uh, occupants of the vehicle always have in their view, and therefore it has to be, um, you know, manufactured in a very nice, elegant way. Um, but you're not always touching the instrument panel with your hands. So therefore, we applied this same leather to the other areas of the interior where you uh, keep it in touch with uh, the surfaces. So for example, on the door, the, uh, the doorboard and the upper area where you rest your arm while driving are not only 
soft in, in the feel, but they also look premium and nice when you, uh, when you look at the line and they're um, the same material, leather material, to match the uh, good impression. That same theme goes around through the entire interior. So we have the armrest and the entire seats wrapped in that uh, leather. Um, and it's not just the leather itself, but also the way it is uh, stitched. So on the uh, leather seats, you find uh, a hexagonal, hexagonal um, seam, which has a perforation. Um, the front seats come standard uh, as heated seats. So that combines uh, the functionality um, of letting the hot, warm air through to uh, the occupants with a very nice and elegant uh, uh, view. The um, hexagon hexagonal theme is uh, framed with a stitching line, which is very precisely following um, the theme. There are some. There are some uh, visual design themes that are putting some uh, accents into the appearance. Not only on the seats with these tuxedo lines, you see a contrast on between the black leather base and um, the white cashmere color uh, tuxedo stripe. That same um, theme is followed in the doors to make it a con consistent appearance yes. all throughout. Yes. Um, one other key aspect is we have standardized in the Fort Mondeo Vignale a few of the comfort features. So for example, um, the, um, the memory function that is, can be programmed to individual drivers so that at a switch of a button, um, you can see that on the driver door over there. You can uh, set the memory function to adjust the steering wheel height and depth, the seat position and the mirror um, angles so that every time you enter your vehicle and press a certain number, you get uh, the pre-setting of, uh, of your, um, the, the right location. Um, on top of that, the um, Ford Mondeo Vignale is equipped with a new technology, which is active noise cancellation. Um, that is intended to give the whole driving experience a very quiet, relaxing impression. So when you're uh, going through busy uh, times on the road, you can concentrate on what's happening in the traffic and you don't need to be sidetracked with uh, noise. The way that works is you can see in the headliner, I point over here, for example, there is one uh, microphone here, but there are multiple in the headliner distributed. And these microphones are constantly monitoring the background noise that you experience on the inside of the vehicle. And then there is a mini computer in the radio equipment, which is then producing through the loudspeaker system of the audio uh, system. Uh, counter waves to cancel in out some of the links in to cancel out some of the uh, noisy uh, un inconvenient background noise and that helps you bring the overall noise level uh, further down um, the same um, intention is realized with a few other features that are less visible even so on the side glass we have uh, used now uh, laminated glass, which is multiple layers of glass with a foil glued in between. Um, that has the purpose of better uh, wind noise isolation. And ag again, that helps to reduce the noise level yes, that thanks. you get burdened with in inside the car. So far, Uli Kerstas from Ford Motor Company. We have tested this car and uh, 
find it uh, has succeeded. Uh, English newspapers said it could be a challenger for premium cars from BMW, Audi or Jaguar. Uh, I do not agree. Uh, I think it's a car for Ford drivers who can afford a little bit more luxury uh, in September. This car can be yours for 40,000 euros.